Hi everyone, Carla here from the Republica program team. I'm going to give you a little step-by-step uh, -step tour of the Republica website backend and show you uh, exactly how to hand in uh, a proposal to the corporate participation. It's rather easy and only takes about 10 to 15 minutes if you've got all the info gathered. So let's start. Um, the first step is to register yourself in the Republica database. So for this you go to the bottom of the page on login and then create new account. Um, then you fill in your data. Um, Just anything, this will be taken, so I'm going to pick a new one. Okay, and then um, please tick the box speaker. Okay, you will then uh, receive an email uh, with further instructions, including how to set up your password. Once you've done that, um, go back to the login page and log in. Okay. And here's your speaker profile. So I'll show you quickly what you need to fill in. Um, so name is done. Uh, you, you will need to um, upload a profile picture and a short bio, um, as well as your organization name and the link to the website. It could be also um, your personal blog, your personal website, anything. Uh, position is optional and optional as well are um, a bunch of links here if you want to include social media links um, yeah, as you want. Here's some info for statistical purposes um, and here you can change the password if you like and uh, change the site language. So let's go back to the home page. So um, to submit a proposal, first um, click on dashboard and then my dashboard. And here you'll find the following options. Add a session, create um, a lounge or create marketplace, which means yeah, apply for a spot in the marketplace. So I'll start with uh, the session. Here we go. Here's uh, what the form looks like quickly. Just to show you the length. And let's yeah, go back step by step. On the right side, you'll find the session guidelines, uh, which are very important. They're kind of like the terms of refer reference for um, submitting and holding a session at Republica. Um, so it's very important that you read them um, through and pay attention to them. So let's start. Uh, we will need a title, a short thesis, a description which is uh, longer um, and describes in detail what your session is about. Um, here you will have to pick a track, so the main topic category um, of your session um, and pick a format. So you can either hand in a talk, a discussion, a workshop or an action. Um, here's a quick introduction to the possible formats. Uh, you'll find more information in the FAQs, which are here. If you go to submitting a session um, and then also in the session guidelines, there's um, a bit of info on the possible formats and the requirements. So let's go back. 
Um, here you need to pick uh, the required audience experience. So is it a session for beginners? Is it for experts? Is it for everyone? Select the duration, 30 or 60 minutes. The language, in this case English. Um, if you'd like to hold your session in French, uh, that is also an option. Um, if you'd like that, please let us know in the comment box here below. But this will only be um, very, very few sessions in total. Um, here's the box for the speakers. So you can either hold your session alone or add further speakers. So if you want other people, want to add other people, sorry, um, <clears throat> start typing their name and wait for the autofill and then um, click on the person. It's very important that you wait for that autofill and not just write any name and then leave because otherwise it's not going to find the according person in the database. Um, this is nothing. Um, here's a field for the speaker experience. So um, for Republica Accra, um, each speaker should provide a reference of his previous speaker experience. Uh, so it can either be the link to a video recording um, or just infos about uh, the conference that you've spoken at before. Um, if this would be your first public speaking experience, that's okay as well. Um, then just please record a short video of you pitching your session to us. So just a short video um, of maximum three minutes, um, just so we can better assess your speaking skills. Um, here's a comment box uh, for anything um, you need to tell us. Uh, any spatial requirements or technical requirements you might have to conduct your session. Yeah, and that's all. Um, here you will be asked to uh, tick the, um, this box. So it means you read and agreed to our session guidelines, which are above. Um, so this is mandatory. Okay, so then you click on save which I'm not going to do because I didn't fill out uh, all the required fields, so it's not going to work, but click on save and for you it's going to work. <laughs> okay, so let's go back to the dashboard and have a look at the launch form. Here it is. Um, this is the length. It's rather short as well. Um, you'll find a section in the FAQs about it as well, here in the end. Um, and also, of course, it's good to look at the general questions um, about the coffee participation that are here, because they apply to all uh, possible formats. So, let's go back. Um, so, here's uh, the info we, we will need from you. First, the topic of your lounge, a short description, um, a program concept, so basically um, what participants could expect to find your lounge. Then please describe to us uh, the learning experience and top takeaways for people coming to visit your lounge, as well as why uh, you and your organization are qualified to host the lounge. Then please pick a track. Um, again, it's the overarching um, topic category of your lounge. And then you're allowed to um, uh, to add um, as far as four, four hosts um, in total. So here again, um, start typing and then wait for the autofill and select a person from the list. Um, yeah, don't just write something and go on because it's not going to find the person in the database otherwise. 
Here's a box for the technical, physical and spatial requirements um, you will have. And a comment box for anything that's left um, to tell us. Okay, then click on submit. And that's it. So let's go back to the dashboard. And let's apply for a spot in the marketplace. Here it is. Um, yeah, here's the form. Again, you'll find a section in the FAQs uh, just for the marketplace. Here. And again, it's good to look at the general call for participation questions as well. Okay, so first thing, please provide the name of your organization and if you want, um, a link to your website. Then please give us a short description of uh, your organization and what you do. Then please tell us um, what would be the top takeaways for people coming to visit, to visit your exhibit, a maximum of 500 characters. And here's the products field. So I'm uh, going to pick one. So yeah, um, please select how many products you want to show. It can be a maximum of three. I'll just do one because it's uh, the same for all three. So um, please type in the name. Um, here, please explain to us why this is an innovative and impactful product we should feature. It doesn't have to be long, again, 500, uh, 500 characters. And then if you want, you can upload a photo and uh, add a video link. Here, again, um, please pick a track. Uh, so the main um, topic category of your um, organization and products. And then you can add um, up to two presenters. So again, um, please start typing and then, and then wait for the autofill and click on the person. Um, yeah, please don't just type something um, and leave because uh, it's not gonna connect the person um, in the Republica database with your um, proposal. Here's a box for your technical, physical and special requirements. And a comment box for um, anything, any questions you have or anything you need to tell us. Then click on submit, uh, which again, I'm not gonna do because I didn't fill out the, um, all the fields. Yeah, that's all. So let's go back to the dashboard. So if you're here and um, you see sessions uh, popping up or a lounge here or a marketplace, this means that um, your proposal has been submitted and the program team can see it as well and there's nothing else you need to do. So as long as you can see it here, um, everything's fine and just wait for our message. <laughs> Okay, um, so if you have any questions left, uh, please just contact us via program uh, pra at republica.com. Uh, we'll be here to help. And also, again, here's uh, the FAQs, which are very helpful um, yeah, in case you have any questions. Okay, so that was it. Um, yeah, looking forward to receiving your proposals. Good luck.